So over here, you can see that I have a database file opened up. And what you can also do is add in details to the properties of this database file. So to do that, you need to go to the file menu right here. And then what you need to do is go to info over here. So once you go to info, you can see that view and edit database properties is an option. So if I were to click over here, then you can see that these are the properties for database. So you can change around the title of the database. So let's say, for example, this is going to be for TutorTube and you can add in a subject. Let's say, for example, this is going to be basics right here. You can go around and add in as much as details as you wish right here. And you can see different things right here. Like, for example, you can add in client right here, like you can add in date and things just like this to the properties and attach out different information to the properties. You can also add in keywords right here, add in comments right here. Let's say, for example, this is for uh, this is for educational purposes. I just like this, I'm just going to go around right here and add in this detail. And now what happens is that all of the details are now here in this particular file. So that is how you can uh, add in properties for documentation of uh, the databases file as well. And that is how you can view and edit database properties inside a Microsoft Access. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.